Oop. Hello and welcome everyone. This is is Doc Williams. Oh, I'm getting some eco. Echo, not eco. Oh. Okay, cool. So let's do this, guys. Um again, if this is the first time you, you're watching, uh my name is Doc Williams from Brand Factor Inc. And uh, this is a new program, a new uh, initiative that we have called Build With Me. So I'm actually building a business live with you guys for about an hour or so. And um, this is actually the new website we just built. It's out of Notion. And uh, it's, again, so we build a business within an hour. I'll show you actually the homepage too. Hold on, guys. So really simple, but I like it a lot. My wife built this. So shout out to her. Um, this is build with me. So we create a business in one hour. And uh, this is a landing page. Let's build. It goes right into the Notion page. Here, you see all the episodes. You can get all the episodes. And uh, you'll be able to see the stream too. I have the stream up. I don't know if no if it's going to pull it or not. Oh, wait a minute. See? It's showing, it's generating good stuff, right? So it will stream live right there. If you want to watch it there, you can watch it on uh, YouTube as well. Look at that. Yep. It switches to all the players right there. That's pretty awesome. So again, guys, this is um, this is where we build businesses every single weeknight, every night right now. We're going to do 40 days straight. Um, this is actually episode eight. We're not going to be talking about textile. That's actually going to be um, uh, probably later in the week. We're going to be talking about um, oh po podia. Let me um, let me switch out. So let me switch this. I got a lot on my desktop. There we go. Okay, let's do that. Okay, so tonight we're going to be building with uh, podia, and uh, again, like a lot of the things that I'm doing you'll see me working on projects and uh, I want you to ask questions, build your business with me. There's a lot of stuff going on right now in the world and uh, small businesses are really taking a really big hit. So yeah, that's, that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be talking about how you're going to build a business courses, membership site with code uh, with Podia. And uh, I'm going to show you what I've been working on over here as well. We're going to create a course for one of our uh, new returning apprentice coming on bo board as a um, jazz yeah, just overall. I'm really excited to, to be working with her again. So we're going to be building out a course and showing you behind the scenes with Pod Podium. Uh, we're going to be looking at a site that we modeled off of this with paper form. We're going to add some opt ins um, and all kinds of stuff. So we're going to have sections of Podia. I'm going to be talking about that. Uh, and then it's going to be updating our business. Updating. Um, uh, I'm going to say creation of new website with card and notion. Okay, so that's the name of this episode. Let's see. And then again here. Uh, when you're you're watching live, you can actually see what we're building. Every episode, we're doing something different. So tonight, we're going to be um, we're going to be building a whole site, uh, a Podia site. So we're going to be building a online course, all of those things. You can watch us build it. But if you have always wanted to build an online business where it's courses, all these things, again, ask me because I've used Teachable, Podia. Um, Kajabi, all of them, Thinkific, and uh, I use uh, Podia for ours. So I'm going to show you how to build there. So again, in the chat, whatever platform you're using, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll answer all of your questions and uh, just let me know. Also, of course, I'm using Re uh, Restream. So I'm streaming at a couple different platforms. Let me know what's going on here. I'm just going to say, hey, everyone, let me know what you are building. Okay, so 
let me know in the chat. I'll answer all of your questions. Uh, oh, am I on Periscope too? Maybe. Um, so let's get right into it. So if you're trying to create an online business and you're trying to think about what platform, I use Podio because you can create uh, a membership site, a course site, all of those things all in one. So I'm going to access my account. And right now I'm in the middle of building a course. And, uh, and so right here, if you look at it, you can create, let me put it over here, products. So on this platform, I can be building out a new course, online course, digital download, or a bundle, um, a product bundle. I can do that all with Podio. So I don't need to use Gumroad and uh, all these other ones for digital downloads. I can use everything from Podio. So it's almost like Gumroad plus Teachable plus Kinjabi and all these other things plus, what's the other one? Patreon all together. So I've used Gumroad before um, and all that stuff. But the thing is now you can upsell, which just means you can cross sell things. So you can sell downloads, digital downloads, product bundles. And instead of them switching platforms, they got all a bunch of different uh, accounts. They can all be on one account. You can first have them buy a digital download like we did with the Gary V content model. And then later on, I can say, hey, I can uh, market to them again and say, hey, there's a new online course about what you just downloaded. Maybe you should buy it. And I can message them. I can create a membership site all on the same thing. So I am working on a new um, program. What, what, hold on. I'm going to ask my wife what the name of this thing is. Uh, what, Sabrina, what's, what's the course name? Uh, course name for a brand factory. Is it called Brand Factory Branding 101? Yeah. Okay. Cool. That's it. All right. So let's get right into it. Do that. Let's just preview this. It's not horrible. It's a... Hmm. Well, let's just do getting started. Let's just go through these. So what I'm doing right now is I'm actually building a course, downloading the contents and then putting it back in. So I'm doing that and uh, let's work on that. Let's work on that. Again, let me know what's going on in the chat. You can ask me questions. No comments in chat right now. It's okay. I'm just putting on some music in the background as I build. And let's get started. I wonder why Periscope is having a problem. Okay, let's see about this. Downloading that. Let's upload. Add files. Let's 
look at this. Oh. Let me charge that. I'm going to be buying a domain. Let's see this. Build, build with me. Dot gg. Let's do this. Um. that much per year how to buy a domain name there we go Let's see what we got here See about this. Build. What? I'm charging it. Yeah. What do you think about this? They're saying the domain build with me $99 a year. What do you think about that? Yeah. That much? I wanted it to be cheaper. Build with me. Check in other places. Just makes me sad. You know what I'm saying? Cost. 
cost. Well, let me see what I can do. That or we can change this. Or it doesn't have to be GG. What do you think? Yeah. I could do build with dot me. Let me see there that. See what we got here. You know, what am I thinking? I need to start doing Google domains. I don't trust all these other fools. We got here. Let's do this. Uh, let me add this uploading right now so I'm doing multiple things guys so first of all I'm uploading um, files to build this course so there's that then I'm building I'm buying a domain potentially okay Okay, let's see. Build. Let's see about this. Got results. See all endings. Let's see about this. Hmm. Build with me. Dot me. <laughs> Build with me dot mx. Build with me dot church. Build with me dot tech. Not feeling it? No. Hmm. Gotta think about this. Hmm. You thought of a couple domains, right? You looked them up? Yeah. Let me take a look. Yeah, let me take a look.
surprised. Who? Mm. Mine was just a token. <laughs> you going back and forth drawing in that? Hmm? You drawing in going back and forth? Sabrina. Sabrina, yeah, so you say that about every single thing that you do. Okay, didn't you say you don't like the in-between things anyway? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Alright, everybody. Let's get back right into it. So, I'm doing a couple things. Okay, uploaded that. Okay, good, right there. Okay, one, two. Okay, 30 day rev challenge, let's look at this. I want to get info, control A, cancel. Okay, pull this up. interesting okay download did I download this yet no download that right, what else we got so right here I'm building out so we have a lot of the placements right there I just gotta go and um and start adding uh, the the exact uh, URL and video. So that's what I'm doing. All right, let's see what we got here. Um, names, probably under no code. Oh. Here we go. I like actually, well, I like buildwithme.tech. What do you think? Buildwithme.tech or buildwithme.online? Dot online. You like buildwithme.tech? No, the other one. Dot online? You just like give me the runaround. Mm-hmm. Build with me. Oh, I thought it said build with me meow. What it says now. Hmm. Build with me dot tech. And it kind of fits too. I like that. So build with me dot tech. Exact match. Okay, so where did you get the prices here? Bluehost? Shoo. We're going to Bluehost. All the other people are gouging me. Same exact domain name. They wanted forty dollars instead of four dollars a year. Yeah, like, how can they do that? That's highway robbery. Insane. That's why people don't trust people. It's insane prices. Okay. Add file. 
drop 30 day rev challenge. All right, let's go to Bluehost. We're going to log in. Let me just. I'm going to change it to camera for a second just because I'm logging into my account. I know all you people watching out there trying to log into my account because we have so many people watching right now. But still, I don't trust it. People could be watching this, watching replays. That's why I switched cameras. Tonight, I'm drinking a mini Dr. Pepper, a small can. I actually like these small cans. I, I waste most of the drink anyway. But not the small ones. Delicious. All right. Let's take a look at this bad boy. Add domain. Oh, yeah, yeah. Now I can switch back. You're just looking at my face for a second. All right. Let's take a look. We're back. Build with me dot tech. Let's check. What the build with me dot tech is taken. <sighs> hmm. Let's take a look. Let's just take a look at this thing. Build with me. Five other, 50 other. Oh, I thought that said build with me dot alchemy. I was like, well, hello. What? Yeah, it's only build with me dot academy. Mm. Not as great. I don't think there's a domain like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I know. Build with me dot training. Nah. Build with me dot online. Build with me dot space. No, I wish dot space, not in space. Yeah. I hate dot biz. I hate that. I just don't like biz never caught on ever. Um, build I'll build a business with me nah oh. build with I'm just gonna say build let's see what we got for build Hmm, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Build with dot tech. You know what I'm saying? So it's almost like build with tech, but it's build with dot tech. <laughs> you do <laughs> like yes I do understand what you're saying build with doc mm-hmm. what about build with doc yeah dot what I thought you were saying build with dot dot <laughs> <laughs> look you know there's build with doc dot com oh get that build with doc dot com how much eleven dollars yeah get that that's the best one build with doc yeah let's get that yeah, who am I kidding? Alright, it's going. Oh, yep. Yeah. Thought so. What? Yeah. Yeah, build with Doc. I know that. 
All right, guys, hold on. I got to hide all this information so you stop trying to steal stuff from me. Because I know you people out there. Hold on, let me just finish this stuff up. Okay. Yeah, what do you think about that? Yeah. In a dot com? Shoo. Can't ask more than that. If only that old country singer would just sell me his domain. DocWilliams.com. He ain't doing that, though. You know, maybe I should. Hmm. Maybe I will. That's on the projects for tomorrow. Yeah, $25 a year is not bad, right? $25 for two years. What do you think about that? No, it's not bad. Not that. In the world of building failure. Take a look at this. <sighs> Build the talk. I think the show should still be called Build with Me, though. Checking some things, guys. Oh, yeah, we're good. real quick all right guys just finishing up right here All right, let's take a look, guys. It's looking like we'll get the... Hooray! Yep. 
purchase. So, good times. Um, buildwithdoc.com. Buildwithdoc.com. So, that's going to be one of your assignments for tomorrow. Attaching Bluehost new domain name to card site. That's pretty exciting. Well, let's take a look. All right, I'm switching back, guys. Now, I told you, today is an update. So we're working on our business in real time so you can see, like, what we're doing. So we just bought a domain. I'm going to add this to Squid Hub so the team can uh, do all that tomorrow. Let's see. Sabrina's going to do all that tomorrow. It's better that you have a team to do add new domain build build with doc dot com to attach it to card site build with me have that deadline for tomorrow. Good times. Got that. Create that. Done. Okay. Next one, we're still working on uh, Podia. What's going on with that? Okay, so we updated that. Upload. Okay. Rev challenge. Good. Um, 30 day rev challenge. Okay, next one is four stages of awareness. Copy. Switch this out. Any comments? New domain for the nightly show. Build with me is called. I'm kind of happy. Build with doc dot com. Like we'll attach it tomorrow. That's good. Okay, so, okay, we're downloading that. Four stages of awareness. Okay, we did that. Let's add this. So right now I'm just adding, we had the links, but they're to uh, a um, cloud app. So right now we're, re we're reintroducing it just as a embedded uh, video. Okay, doing that. All right, so that's working on that. All right, let's look at that other page that we saw. Paper form, let's take a look at this. Um, let's do this. One second. Oh, it's just receipts. Okay. Let's go here. Mm. 
working on that. Take a look at this. Podia create cores, blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's see. So this is one of the sites uh, in uh, card in Notion. site yeah, I like this menu right here Kind of like that. Come on, let's do this. Okay. So right now I'm working on the Notion page. Checking how they did that. Like that. Let's see. Switching some things around. You know, how they describe this one over here. It's featured in the new AppSumo um, blog post. I'm trying to see how she did this. This. Google Trends. Let's see this build with me.
see. Name is Doc Williams. No me. Join us every night. during the live show. Can't make the show. The recordings. Straight to your email once a week here we go There we go. Up, 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 up. Let me see about this. This paper form. Let me see if I can do something similar to how they're doing. Hey, Sabrina. Yeah. Can I can I imitate how this person is doing this over here? Oh, yeah. Yeah. You're on camera. Oh. It's right there. You want me to shut the camera off? No, you're fine. What, what am I, uh... So, you see this over here? That line? What line? You see that border? Oh, the sign line? Yeah. Okay, so go back to yours. Yeah. So, let's add a new block. Click plus. Right here. Okay, now... Should, it should be a... Hmm, yeah, quote. quote. Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. And, and then, then copy, copy and paste this. Yeah, or you could also take this mm -hmm. and just turn it into a quote. So you mm. click those little dots. Turn into quote. Mm. And just, well, yeah, it might work better the other way. But, yeah, you got the idea.
Let me just... Copy it, yeah. Yeah, hold on. I got you. Yeah. Thanks, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that looks better. You like how it looks? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how they did that, though. Maybe. How did they? I'm trying to give spacers, but it's... Hmm. But, uh, it should be easier than this. Um, like separators per line. Hold on. Let me just I'm gonna do it the old fashioned way. I had to put this as a Google Doc. Let's get what I want. Copy. Ugh. Okay, there we go. This. This. Next. Kind of redundant. Okay. That right there. Ugh. See this, Sabrina? See, this works, but you see how this is spaced? Uh huh. Look. I'm not sure. I think it's okay even without, though. All right. Or what we could do is copy that over into your text editor, put in the spaces, and then when you paste it, see if it. You mean this one? Formatting. Yeah. Yeah, I already did. Oh. Didn't. It's weird. Yeah. Oh well. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Okay. It's good. Don't be deleting stuff.
see about this. Build with me. My Gmail. Let me add a new space. Build with me. Let's do this. Create a new form. Let's make it real basic from scratch. Real, real basic. Just like that question, email. This email. Your preferred email address. Save, let me view this. Let's configure this title basic opt in for um, build with me newsletter. Let's see, payments, behavior, let's go with colors. Background, we gotta go with button. Button, 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 button. Text, active, there we go. Your preferred email. Let's do it. Um, we have that. Share. Embed. Embed. Inline. Let's try to do this. Let's move right here. Let's add. Let's see if it's going to work. Bro, we don't need that. Delete. Let me add that. How did they add that text block? Figma. Let's try this again. Makes me mad. Let's do that. Embed. The URL works with links. All right, let's take a look at this. Let's do it again. Share. Hey, oh, wait, wait, share. P 
part of the pop up screen. Hmm. Paste the relevant code. What about this? How did they do that? Let me see about this. Let's see about this. Uh -huh. Twitter. Uh -huh. Meta tag. Okay. Notion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Property. Hmm. I see that viewpoint. I see that, yeah. I guess I could do that too. Take a look at this. I wonder if I can just use that. Mm, I wonder if they did that.
Mm-hmm. Could be that simple, though. What is this? Oh, the first ones. Thank you. Maybe it's just that. I'm just going through checking this thing. Have an idea. There you go. Yeah, it was that simple. Take a look at this. There we go. Da, 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 da. Save changes. Refresh. Okay, so, Notion, no need to embed, embed with iframe. Just drop link. 
link. Okay, drop link there. Okay, next part. I like sections like this, but not right now for me. Probably just headers right there, really. I mean, it's right there. Then tools. It's pretty cool. That's interesting. Hmm. Really like this section. Yep. Uh, that. Fire. Mm -hmm. Put that right there. Let's see about this. Cool. Okay, I like that a lot. Export for paper form. Let's add this. Um, integrations. Convert kit. And then what we're gonna say? Ba -ba -bum -bum -bum. Okay. Two. No code. Hundred days. Okay. Squared hub. Like that. My name is Doc. Boom. Subscribe. Episodes. One thing I will do. I like how later on tools. Like that a great deal. Yep.
Restream. Periscope. Adding embed, adding uh, um, paper form, um, opt in, adding paper form opt in, in Notion website. There we go. Opt in. Mm -hmm. What did you put interested in? No. Interested in build with me? Build with me. What was the tag that you made? Why don't you sort by date? What, the tags? Yeah. Oh. Oh. Well, just do control F and type build. Hmm. Mm-mm. Uh, click next. Build with me viewers. There it is. Okay, cool. Oh, you're doing real good with that. What do you think? Yeah. What do you say? Way better than my first thing that I did. What was your first thing? <laughs> but you should keep it so you can show oh, the difference. Yeah. Shutting this off so that way you can't see my API real quick. Sorry guys, give me one second, I'll stop showing my face in a second. What? Mm, I know. I see a lot of people show their APIs and secret APIs. I'm like, mm hmm. Even even a company I like 
Yeah, a company I really, I really like. I'm like, you're showing off what? Hmm. Maybe they think people are just too nice. I'm just like, nah, man. People will steal that. Cool. Who's that? Who's chicken now? What are you saying? Probably. Oh, yeah, well, that makes sense. Add subscriber to tag. Okay. Tags. Last submission, make sure that you have some. Try again. Oh, okay. Okay, submission. Doc Williams. Edit. Edit right there. Opt in with Notion, good. New website. Good. Okay. Um, let's go with uh, integrations and everything. Okay, we had this one right here. Add a tag. Already there. Four minutes ago, tag. There we go. Email. Add the email. There we go. Finish setup. Are you sure you want to continue without testing? Cancel. Let's test that. Success. There we go. That's fine. Shut that off. Okay. History. That's fine. So, all well, all good things. All right, so finish that up. Let's see about this update.
doc there. Doc's pretty much signed up for everything. It's it, huh? Yeah. There we go. Build with me. There we go. So. Let's talk about this. I need a. Um, There we go. There's the site. Sabrina. Take a look at this when you get a chance. Oh, well. We'll go on from there. Okay. Build a site. Site with card post submission. I might make that a video tonight. Okay, cool. All right, let's go into Podium. There we go. Brand redesign. We just did all that. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Now let's take a look at these. Let's just edit. Let's just delete these. Delete link. Yep. 
copy link. Okay, let's look at this. What? That's the link. Okay. Go edit. Formally welcome you. This course you will. Discover our main internal process on how we manage our team, projects, and social media outreach and expansion. We practice. We strive to practice the same structure and principles. We still and all of our clients and students. In this course, you will find the structure the methodology of how we create compelling stories and craft a, a brand that innovates and empowers. Click here for the class curriculum. Book one. 
Books History. There we go. Cool.
Okay. See Sabrina, you want to see it? I finished uh, page. I can shut it off. Hold on. Let me switch this. Let me shut the camera off. I'll mute. I'll be right back, guys. All right, everybody, let's do this. Let's do this. So how long have we been building? We've been building at two hours on the dot, on the money, on the dot. So uh, we're gonna get right into this as the review part of the video. So as you can see, you can see in real time, we just uh, built out Build With Me, the new website in Notion dropped embed code right there um and this was inspired earlier today i was thinking about doing a notion website anyway and uh one of my friends was talking about that they were working on a api to integrate um webflow and notion they said they were just having trouble and they were going to do it later so um then i woke up and gil was put out the no code coffee and I was like, oh, a Notion website? I was just thinking about that. And then I uh, saw someone else do it. I'm like, I'm going to do it today. I saw that you could do it in, <laughs> excuse me, in card. I was like, I'm just going to do it. So we did that. We integrated um, Paperform, which integrates with ConvertKit. Uh, we have all the episodes right here. We're going to start dropping links and videos of all of them and uh, recaps and all that kind of stuff. But as you can see, we have the basics right here. Um, and again, this was inspired just doing a hundred days of no code and kind of just figuring it out and getting ideas and seeing what we could do. So what we're going to do is we're going to do an overview of this and, uh, and get right into this. So how do we start this thing off? Well, let's do it. And here we go. All right, y'all, this is Doc Williams with Build With Me. Uh, this is episode 
eight. And we're gonna be talking about Podia and then we're talking actually about how we created a chorus um, based business, talking about updates of what we did. We created a website today with Card and Notion. So um, uh, yeah, this interview, this, <laughs> this interview, this, this session is gonna be broken up in a couple different parts. So let's talk about Podia first. So what in the world is Podia? Well, if you haven't seen it, it's podia.com right here and everything you need to sell online courses, downloads and memberships without worrying about tech. Honestly, it combines five different tools all in one uh, content. So your CRMs, your customers, your emails, your subscribers, payments, data all in one place and your products uh, smooth and uh, without you needing to just, uh, you know, tech stack this and with duct tape to get everything to work. Um, I really like this. I've used Teachable in the past, Thinkific, Kajabi, um, uh, Heights platform, uh, Envato. I've used a lot of them, a lot. Uh, I like this one because it's all integrated. It talks to one another. And really, if I was just getting started and I didn't want to do a lot of the tagging and advanced follow-ups like I do on ConvertKit, I would just use Podia. If I'm looking for what, how can I save money? How can I streamline my entire business? I can do 98% of my entire business, 90% probably, 90 to 98% all on Podia. So that's why I'm going to show you why we use it, how we use it, all those kind of stuff. So again, it's an all-in-one digital storefront. Who would who would use this? I think influencers, content creators, info marketers, all can benefit from this. Podcasters can do this as well. Um, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna say podcasters, everyone. So basic skills needed, entry level, it's an easy setup. Um, and these are the three business ideas that I have for um, for Podia and what you would do. Number one, for your, for your platform or for your brand, I see building a membership site really, really easy. And uh, again, really valuable for your, for your people because a lot of people need support and um, the, vari the variety of different types of memberships they have on this thing is incredible. It acts very similar to Patreon. You can do all different things. The tier system is amazing on this thing. We'll go into core, I mean, um, uh, memberships later on. Right now, I'm not using that feature, but I see a huge benefit of that. Their email marketing, by the way, is really spot on, really, really easy. I love it and also their online courses that they make, uh, or the way that, the, basically the UI UX to put them together. So for me, if I'm looking for an easy win, I already have a following, people are always asking me for things, and I can do something in like cohorts or you know memberships or you know sprints, I look at memberships, like that, that's gonna be like the biggest thing that you should go after. The next one is courses. I mean, you can make anything a course, uh, we have a couple intro courses for them to then work with us. So we're using them on different levels. But we also have courses when people are going to be working with us uh, for apprenticeship, uh, interns. We put them through our Branding 101 course. Later on, we're going to be opening that up to the public for other people to take it. Um, courses just allow you to iterate so much faster or for people to understand your methodology it's just really great. Again, they can learn at their own speed. They don't have to be with you all the time. Uh, and I use courses almost like a library where we're teaching a lot of people. And then for advanced help, we turn them to the library, which is our courses. The other way that I saw firsthand, and I looked at this at, uh, uh, what is it? Virtual Savvies? Virtual Savvies, I think that was the name. Um, I really, really like their company. And what they did was basically they would get course creators or different entrepreneurs. They would pay them uh, a certain amount and then you would just build a course for them. And that would be in their vault. And I really like that. Um, I'm planning on taking that model uh, a little bit this year. But basically they're building all these other people that promote them. They're the hub and, uh, and go from there. I really think that's powerful and not a lot of people utilize that. So... Assignment. How? What, what would I do? Now, actually, what I'm going to do is uh, I've been saying the same thing over and over again. And although that might seem like it's cheating, I, I was really thinking about this over and over again. And it's the, the three steps are almost identical over and over again, no matter 
what you're doing when you're building something here. You need to have a catalyst of what you want to do with your business. But then the first three steps are, I really think it's, it's, it's all the same for, for all of these things. I think first you need to pick a business uh, path. Okay. I would say idea or path. So you would pick, you know, one, two or three. Then what you need to do is um, pick uh, uh, or pick a path, pick a path that excites you and also and allows you to grow a business the way you want to. Um, I think that's huge. I think that's huge. And the reason I say that is no matter how much money you can make and all these other things, if you don't pick something that excites you and that it resonates with the way you want to create your business, you're not going to do it. So you need to pick a path that excites you and allows you to grow your business that I'm going to say that aligns with your lifestyle. Okay. And I'm not saying woo woo. I know there's a lot going on with the economy right now and I'm not downplaying that. But what I'm saying is for you to stick with this long term, um, you, and it, it takes a while to build up a business. It's it, yeah, we build a business in one hour or in one session, what we do tonight, but for it to be successful, it takes time and you need to have a platform and a way to make money that, uh, you know, goes with you. Like say, for instance, we're streaming 1.30 in the morning. The reason it works is because I have energy in the middle of the night. I want to do things. So I need a business where I can work on it when I feel like it, when I get energy. And that's what capitalizes. I can't work in a nine to five and be, a, you know, efficient at, not efficient, but excel at it. I can. I've been a I've done tons of jobs where I just slugged through the day and, you know, I had good performance or I was, you know, at, at the level that they needed to be, but I, I didn't accelerate. I can accelerate with the style of this business because this is how I move through time and space. I need creative time. I need all these things. You need to figure out what gives you energy, what gives you space, what gives you that creativity to get to the next level. And maybe it just starts out as side hustle or just a hobby for now, but you've got to see where you can do this every day. Like say for instance, we're doing this on, what are we on day eight? Like to tell you the truth, like you can ask anyone, any of my friends, you'll see me online. You can ask my wife, like, this is how I, I, I act like this even when I'm not streaming, right? So I'm, I'm working on things. So you got to figure out what, what are things, what are the business, what are the type of business that you can be doing, and it's still going to give you a lot of joy. Um, the next thing is um, I would find 10 to 15 people that need this, right? Focus on the solution that you're going to provide. So I really think you need to find that many people. And on top of that, tier the people into three tiers a list a list b list c list and what you need to do is focus on b list first focus on how you can help them and b list should be people right above you c list should be people below you or you they don't have the greatest audience or something like that a list is like listen the cream of the crop in your industry the reason you want to go after b list is you got to understand what makes people want to work with you and if you can't get b list you're certainly not going to get a list and c list might not work with you either it's almost like you're reaching out just enough they're a little bit above you they might not work with you or they say hey i like what you're doing keep doing x y and z and we can work with you in the future you want to be reaching out and I, I think you should always do that. And I'm not saying anyone like if, first of all, you shouldn't tell everyone your tears uh, to their face anyway. And number two is if you're saying C list, don't, don't, um, don't feel like, oh, they're in a series. They, they might just not have as many skills as you or email list or whatever and vice versa on you. You might have the expertise, but you don't have any traction. They have traction. So you've got to understand like the pros and cons. So if I'm doing the tier list, I'm going to say, why do I think they're in that tier? What can I get from them? Or what can I give them that will make them want to work with me? Right? You've got to, you've got to do that. And then that will help you get through this a lot easier.
And then after that, start helping and then show them the results. So for this one that you might say, hey, listen, you got a great brand. All this stuff is working. But I notice you don't have a course like you're just selling product and you're only making like five bucks a sale. If you do this instead, you're going to be making fifty dollars a sale or a hundred or five hundred. You know, think about, you know, for them, see like, hey, I would love to show you how to do it. And I would love to partner with you or, you know, do this now. And then for an opportunity to do this later or whatever you're, but you've got to get traction. Now, of course, if you've already got traction, then it's a different conversation. But if you're starting out, this is what I would do. Hands down. Um, now, what do we do tonight? Well, a couple things. Number one, we made a brand new website. Um, Sabrina, my wife helped me with this. She actually made the front page. I just made the notion page and then we collaborated. So if you look at this, this was done on card card.co really simple, really lean site build with me, create a business in one hour. Now the way that we did that was, um, I was looking at Gil's, um, newsletter, like I mentioned before, let me pull that out. And the site did the same thing. I saw, Oh, it's a card site. Um, and then they use Notion. I'm like, I'm already using Notion. I should just do this. Instead of making a WordPress site, I could do it really quick. I've made, we've made like hundreds of WordPress sites at this time. I was just getting bored. So um, I just wanted to do this instead. So let me go. I have my no code. I'm just running on autopilot. Let me do this. So this is the site that we saw for an agency. Um, that was in his newsletter. And um, I liked it. And there you go. This is their, this is what I saw. I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. Email, I saw his paper form. I'm like, oh man, I have a paper form account. I can do this. Um, I like this where it says projects. I really like the tool section. That's what I think I want to do. In perks, I'm going to do that similar. I'm going to do this, but uh, at a later time, showing all of the different tools that I love and what I'm doing. I like that a lot. So I'm, I'm going to take that idea right here. It says, let's build right here. It takes you to the um, notion page and I'm signed in right now. So that's why it's going to look different once you're on it. But um, again, it's build with me I said, uh, hey, my name is Doc Williams, and I build a business live every night to help people figure out this crazy economy and figure out what's next for them. Join us so we can build, encourage, inspire, and answer questions during the live show. Can't make the show? Stay in touch and get the recording straight to your email. Subscribe for updates and exclusive ideas. Um, I'm going to change that for um, episodes and exclusive ideas I like that. Uh, I'm going to change this too. And I build businesses live every night to help. Let's say help you build a online business. Oh, that's it. Yeah. Every night to help you shift. building an online business. There we go. Something like that. Um, right there. Subscribe for episodes. For, subscribe for new episodes and exclusive ideas. Uh, stay in touch. Subscribe. Subscribe and get the the recording straight to your email subscribe love that let's do this right there done uh, i have paper form right here integrated with convertkit i have all the the episodes right here that ones i've already recorded all of them um i just uh, i mean it goes straight to youtube and twitch i just gotta take the add the video here and then i'm gonna add the transcripts as well so yeah i'm gonna do that so anyway, this is the website. So we got a lot done today. We built out a new website. Um, we got everything ready for build with me. 
so we can start promoting it to people build with doc.com and um, and we created a course a new course today so like just to show you like that that's what we're doing at brand factory all the time like a lot of people are like oh I'm gonna do this it'll take me a month or whatever it's like let's see if we can just do it in a day let's just start crushing it let's just do it so um, again this is day eight with uh with build with me and uh tomorrow we're going to come back maybe if people want to talk about building an online course business more we'll talk about the concept of it we actually have a course already how to build out a course i know a course building out a course um or just in general a platform that you're looking for if not we'll go use TechSaw instead but that is the plan. So if you have any questions for me, let me know. Again, thank you so much. Really good stuff. Really excited. And uh, it's been really fun. It's been really fun. Uh, thanks for people just popping in and out. We'll be giving out the links to sign up for it. I'm super excited about this. And uh, we'll talk to you soon, guys. All right. Thanks. Take care.